know, Tyler was here his rookie year last year and then second year. Um, nature of the NBA, you know, we, we draft and we have a couple guys and he was out of the rotation for us. Um, you know, one of the hardest working guys that we had on this team. Um, very quiet, soft spoken, but never shied away from the gym or putting in work in the gym. And, um, you know, the conversation we had all along was stay ready and, you know, don't know if the opportunity comes via injury or, you know, you work your way back into rotation or what happened. You know, he gets traded at the deadline and he's in Memphis and hopefully he gets an opportunity to reclaim himself uh, in a new situation. Um, but can't speak more about him as a professional. I, I think he may have been our hardest working guy. He stayed in the gym. He was, he was all consumed with basketball. Um, but it's tough, you know, it's a new coach, new situation, a lot of new players, and, and he was the odd man out for most of the games this year. And so I'm happy for him to be in Memphis, and I'm excited. Hope that he gets the opportunity. And I know, you know, in September when he went and played the two games with the Greek national team, you know, that first go round of, of getting national exposure and, and hoping to continue with that. Um, but it's an adjustment. It's an adjustment for an American player to go over for short periods of time and play. And I know, you know, that was a, a challenge for him to go over there just for a couple of weeks and play. Um, but this is what happens when you're a young player. He's a second year player. He's trying to get national experience and he's trying to get NBA experience. And the best way to do it is the way he's done it and staying in the gym and working on his game.